now, your Precision 18 forecast. News 18, weather from where you live. All right, we're tracking those scattered snow showers tonight. Very fluffy, one inch or less of accumulation. Watch for a few slick spots tomorrow morning. No blowing or drifting tonight, but it will increase with time tomorrow, tomorrow night, and into Sunday morning as a strong wind increases from the south. So east west roadways, watch for some blowing and drifting, and then some mix to rain, and then maybe ending as a little snow uh, as we get into late Sunday, Sunday night. And Monday, the system is slowing down, so much of the precipitation won't be in here on Sunday until later in the afternoon. So it's still a red tomorrow morning for a few slick spots from scattered snow. A few flurries mix the sun and clouds tomorrow, but warmer. A high of 30, that'll feel balmy after a low of 10. Your car wash forecast, this is going to be one of the most popular places to be on Saturday, Sunday, and into Monday. Not the best weather for wax, but you'll be getting that salt and that nastiness off your car as temperatures begin to warm up. We can show you right now with 18 precision cast. Again, upper single digits, the mid-teens for lows tonight as some of these scattered snow showers come in. This is 3 o'clock in the morning. You can still see some of those fluffy uh, snow showers around 4.30 in the morning and still a few even at 7 and 8 before we taper to just a few flurries here and there you can see tomorrow afternoon, but you can see the warmer weather coming in and the strong southerly wind. These are temperatures at 4 p.m. Running near 30 at Lafayette, 32 down at Covington, and mid to upper 20s, Logansport to Rochester. And then after dropping into the upper teens and low 20s tomorrow night, temperatures rise as that strong southerly wind continues. Now looking to Sunday, this is 430. We're in the 30s to near 40 degrees, strong southerly wind with blowing and drifting snow, but the system is slowing down. It's not even in here yet, but then it moves in. It may start as a little bit of snow in our north and eastern counties, then go to just mainly rain, and we'll have that rain around right through the evening. This is solid rain at 1030. I think temperatures will be, uh, temperatures will be running about 37 to about 43 degrees. So a cold rain and a windy rain, but at least much of it will be just rain. And then it may end as a brief bout of some snow early on Monday morning. And then we watch for some rain to develop down here and move in Thursday. And then another round of rain next weekend. I think a third to a half an inch is gonna do it. This seems to be a hair too low. That's gonna do it for whatever we get Sunday evening, Sunday night and on in to Monday. And this is the concern down the road. Got all this snow around, we melt it down. You melt all the snow down, that already gives you an inch and an inch and a half of liquid. The wet pattern's gonna get in here and we're gonna have basically a rain system every few days right into March. And March is looking like this, quite a bit wetter than normal in our area. And with the snow melting, we've gotta watch the flooding risk, especially mid to late March. Now, we have been in a moderate drought, Rivers and lakes have been very low. We could use the moisture. The water's gradually seeping in right now. But uh, to a point, it's going to get to be too much after a while. So we've got to watch for some flooding down the road. 44 Tuesday, 47 Wednesday, 42 Thursday with some rain, 42 Friday. Could see some 50s with rain by next weekend. Okay, Chad, thank you.